Earthsafe continent that was missing for 375 years. In 1642, Dutch sailor Abel Tasman went on a mission. Tasman believed there was a continent in the Southern Hemisphere. He was determined to find it. At the time, this part of the globe was little known to Europeans, but they were certain there had to be a continent. They named the as yet undiscovered land, Terra Australis. Tasman set sail from Jakarta, Indonesia. He eventually ended up at the South Island of New Zealand. His encounter with the local Maori people was disastrous. After a brief scuffle, both sides suffered casualties. Tasman named the fateful location Murderer's Bay. He sailed home several weeks later. He never even set foot on this new land. By this time, Europeans already knew about Australia, but they thought it wasn't the legendary continent. Later it was named after Terra Australis when they changed their minds. Little did Tasman know, he was right all along. There was a missing continent, however most of it was, and is submerged underwater. It took until 1995 to find it, and until 2017 to map it. The continent is called Zealandia. Only about 6% of the landmass is above water. It constitutes the country of New Zealand. Zealandia sank about 60 million years ago. How do we know? It's not just a bulge on the bottom. For starters, it consists of a denser material than the surrounding seabed. It's also raised above the ocean floor. Zealandia thus meets all the criteria of a continent. But unlike all other continents, it lies 3,500 feet underwater. In 2020, researchers finished mapping the entire landmass. It shows the geology of Zealandia in amazing detail. The whole continent spans almost 2 million square miles. That's more than half the size of Australia. Zealandia has mountains and dozens of volcanoes. It broke off the ancient continent of Gondwana 85 million years ago. Earth originally had one supercontinent, Pangaea. It split in two forming Laurasia and Gondwana. Laurasia would split into Eurasia and North America. Gondwana would create Africa, South America, Australia, and Antarctica. But tectonic plates kept rearranging themselves. These shifts led to Zealandia's ultimate submergence. This means that humans never saw Zealandia above water. The first hominids appeared 7 million years ago. The landmass didn't stay above the surface for long. However, it doesn't mean there was no life on it. Scientists have found plenty of fossils. Some of them are very intriguing. For example, Zealandia may have been the birthplace of penguins. The oldest known penguin fossils were found here. They're about 3 million years old, but they point to a much older species of crested penguin. The oldest penguins likely arose 60 million years ago. Zealandia still holds many secrets to be discovered 